And good afternoon, everybody. This is Lon Paul, and we're here doing the Permadeath No Starter Ship No HUD Challenge. We're picking up right where we left off in our last episode. We just saved our save point. Um, we're going really low on our life support. I'm going to see if it'll take one this time. Yep, it did. And then we're going to go ahead and head on out. And let's see if we can find something out in this these wastelands. I feel like I'm on Mars, I swear. Place is like got the red color to it. It looks really cool. I mean, I don't think I'd want to build a uh, you know summer home here, but I kind of like it. But we're definitely not finding enough of what we need. We got plenty of resources. Got our hazard protection. Everything seems to be going pretty well. But yeah, it's just we should be able to find something out here. A uh, minor settlement would have been nice. I found a couple buildings at least in the last couple of episodes. Go feel free to go back to those and check them out. But I'm telling you, I don't know what's going on here. Um, hope you enjoy the new microphone. HyperX solo cast with a shock mount. And I've got it literally inches from my face. So I think you can hear my eyelashes fluttering. Ooh, I want to grab that because I've damaged myself quite a bit lately. And get rid of that. Uh, oh, two. Let's drop you in and get rid of that. Okay, good. I don't need that. Okay. My wife tells me I have the eyelashes that most women dream of, so, you know. No idea what she means by that. Who knows? Maybe I'll show them off a little bit next time I do a uh, stream. No, I'm not wearing mascara. And I can already hear the people that I that normally watch this video start to make surly comments. Yep, surly, I said. And inappropriate ones as well. So stop it. This is a family channel. Alright. Getting up to a higher ridge here so we can see around us a little bit. I'd like to find something. How about you throw me a crashed ship? That would be great. I'll take you. Uh, where is it? There it is. Okay, this direction is which way we're going. I can hear some ships coming. Not bad. Not bad as ships go. I gotta get a screenshot of that one of these days. Nice little, uh, shot of that. They're gonna head, like, probably harsh to the left. Yeah, there we go. Probably come back a little bit the same way. Yeah, there we go. So we're heading in this general direction because this is where they've been pointing us all along. Sorry, I had to clear my throat there. Okay. Let's go ahead and charge you back up. Alright, but again, I'm not seeing anything out there. So, on to the next ridge. There's a nice little mountain right in front of me. Um, except I'm headed more in that direction, so I'm going to keep heading in that direction. It's funny, I was concentrating so much on trying to get uh, condensed carbon, I didn't realize I'm not really mining anything anymore. Are you kidding me? Did I just... Arr, don't make me growl. As the day proceed continues on, I should say, my voice is getting a little bit better from my allergy attack this morning. So I'm starting to settle into my normal voice. A little bit raspy, not bad. I mean, I could take it really low if I wanted to. But, perfectly fine the way I am now, thanks. Um, let me see here. Alright, so we're going to go that general direction is where we've been heading. I see something I want to use. Get a boost in this direction so we can see 
and get further along, please. There we go. Broken machinery, more hills. Got to check out these little deep depressions here once in a while because you never know. Hmm. I'm going to run up that hillside. That's good. I have no idea how many hearts I've got. I probably just have the original three. Life pluses. I don't know what we want to call them. Never really came up with a good name for them. Go back to old Zelda games and stuff. How many hearts you've got? Anything down there? No? It's like just the kind of spot to slap a ship down into. Mr. Procedurally Generated. Can you procedurally generate me a ship, please? What do we got? Nothing. More red dirt. And nothing else. Kind of hard to see anything in here. It's okay. We're going to head up to that ridge and take another closer look if we can. Ow. Really? Technology yep. I had everything I needed to charge that up without using my life support gels. Everything I needed. Yep, just broke something else, didn't I? Oh, good grief. I keep hitting the ground too hard. Anything down here? Nope. Now as I collect some of this stuff, because... You can always use it. You know the one thing they don't have on this planet? They don't have any of the whips. Things that slap you as you run past, if you don't notice them. And I also notice they don't have any of the uh, Venus flytrap style ones, too. They just got those guys. Which is really interesting. I didn't know that you, you know, have one without the others, I suppose. Singular ship heading straight towards the planet that we were heading towards, but he'll he'll dart right at the last second. There he goes, see? How do you know this? It's magic. No, it's not. It's just logic, science, math, experience. There's another one. See if we can get up to the top of this bad boy and take a look around. Now, I have the resources. Keep that in mind. I have the resources to be able to fix any ship that I come across. Okay? Keeping that in mind. I should be able to use my jetpack on this very steep surface that I'm, I'm having trouble getting up. I wonder if you could befriend one of those birds and ride them. That would be great. Okay. Yeah, that got me nowhere. Okay, let's see over the other end of this one. Wow, okay, this this range just continues and just keeps going. All right. Let's try over here. Put it down here. Okay, nope, nothing there. Let's go over here. 
It's more life support gel. Looks like our hazard protection is dropping, though. Yep. Let's... There we go. Use some of that. Uh, so we're heading this general direction, right? So... See if we can get to the end of the range. So we're going to see more, but... I mean, if we're, if, we're, if we're looking for a landing platform, we really need to head this way, but we should be looking everywhere if we want to find a crashed ship. Everywhere is... Yeah. One of those things. Just kind of expected to find something by now. We've literally been doing this for well over two hours. So what I'll probably do, if you haven't noticed already, I'm probably going to be scheduling these things once a day until I find them. And then, you know, whatever breaks, if there's a day that you don't see an episode, is because I didn't record another one yet. Very makes sense, doesn't it? Seems obvious to us. Let me just go over here real quick. Huh. Looks like the perfect depression for something. I'm tempted on heading that way. But I'm supposed to be heading this way. I'm going the wrong direction. Somehow. I don't know how I did that. Yeah. Okay. So we should be heading that way. Let's get to this next ridge over there. This nice flat surface here is good. Do you have two of them? Yes, there is. Okay, did not know that. We'll use the oxygen from that and recharge my life support. ships. A ship. Okay, hang on just one moment, folks. Okay, we're back. Nothing back, like getting interrupted by a phone call in the middle of all that. Uh, let's see. So again, this direction, and we see nothing, as usual. So do we head to that ridge? Or that ridge. Hmm. I like that one. Not that it's taller or anything like that, but it's got a bald, a balder look to it, balder, which means no plants on the top that can get in the way of our view. Gosh, I wish I could make some food and actually ride one of you guys. Can I do that? Nope, not yet. Figures. That would be just a great idea. Oh, for crying out loud. Hit the ground running. Because obviously you don't want to hit the ground running. I mean, that would be too easy, right? Okay. Nothing. Looks like we got a couple nanites out of it. We'll wait till it gets down a little further before we add anything to it. But I'm probably going to use a battery on it this time, so we can actually start using up those batteries. Yes, I went quiet there. Sorry. Too much thinking involved today. Wow. Okay, yeah. Open your mouth and talk. Sorry. My apologies. 
Okay. We're back. Sorry about that. Brain is back. Oof. Wouldn't it just be wonderful if I could find myself a crash ship? It sounds like there was a ship coming for a moment there. Maybe not. Okay, I've got to save my jetpack for this. It will give out by the time I get to the top. Hmm. Nice view, though. Reserve judgment till we get to the top. All right. This one is a tall one. Huh. Wow. Another stage of hazard protection lost. Yeah, and it looks like life support's getting a little bit low, too. Uh, let's see. Why don't we do... There we go. That looks pretty good. Funny, I've got some actual jazz in the background here. It just goes really hilarious with this whole run. We're gonna die! Do, 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 do. Hmm. Alright. So this is where I was hoping to get to. Because this is really high up. That looks like a small settlement. Oh, okay, that's one of those five buildings that you can destroy. Where are you guys going? You should be heading maybe slightly to the left. That'll be even better. Oh, to the right. How weird. Interesting. Medium. Ah, uh, big sigh. So all we've got is that one place right there at the five buildings. And we've been to one just like that recently. It's amazing. I'm finding more hidden or secret places than... Yep, I can't put anything down, can I? Yep. I'm gonna head that direction, but... I was really hoping to see something from up here. As high as I've climbed, you know? Alright. Ready? How much damage do you think I'll take? Break anything? No? Alright. There we go. Nice gentle landing that time. Oh, it looks like that's a... Well, that's weird. Now, why couldn't I see that from up there? You gotta be telling me I'm not gonna be able to see these things from a distance? Interesting. Hmm, that's going to really put a little crimp in the old, uh... Yeah, hmm. That's going to give us some problems. Alright. Oh, much longer? Ten minutes? Oh, that's that? That was me. Ha <laughs> ha. Very interesting. I didn't think it took. 
All right. Well, that's good. Well, you know what I'm probably going to do here, folks? I may be cutting this one a little bit short. I think we're going to cut this one out at about the 25-minute mark. And I'm going to call it for the day for myself. Because I have done about five or six recordings today. And I'm actually starting to get a little worn out, a little famished. I'd like to get something to eat. Maybe go on a date with my wife. That would be kind of nice, don't you think? I think that would be good. So let me get up to another ridge and we'll go ahead and save it there. And since this auto saves now, we don't have to worry about uh, finding a save point like a abandoned settlement or something. Get up to the top of the ridge. Looks like daylight is about to appear. And then we're going to call it. Yep. Guess we're calling it here. Alright, folks. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the series so far. We're going to keep going here in just a little while. And uh, watch in the next episode. Maybe we'll find something this time. Because I'm literally not finding anything. You'd think we'd find something by now. So, good luck to us all. And uh, again, thank you for watching. Take care.